Hi, I am Dr. Ganesh Krishnan Iyer and I am the Chief Cardiac Surgeon here at the Astor Hospitals in Bangalore. Today I want to talk to you about a procedure called the Ozaki procedure. Many patients uh, require aortic valve surgery either because it's regurgitant or leaking or it is stenotic for various reasons. Now when this happens, the usually recommended treatment is what is called as a aortic valve replacement or a repair procedure that can be performed. However, there is a new procedure on the block called the Ozaki procedure. This procedure actually uses your own tissue from your own body, a part of the membrane uh, which is covering the heart called the pericardium. The surgeon takes a large piece of the pericardium out, cuts it into the dimensions as specified and reconstructs an entire new aortic valve from your own tissue. Now isn't that wonderful really to have a tissue valve instead of having a pig valve or a cow valve, a valve that is tailored to you and made from your own tissue. Now the ideal patient to in whom this would be preferred is a patient who is in a rural area who cannot monitor the anticoagulation as required uh, as we call the um, international normalized ratio or the blood thinning that is monitored regularly. Now if that is not possible, this is a very ideal situation. This is also highly recommended for women in their childbearing age who have not yet completed their family, would like to complete their family because this procedure does not require a patient to take blood thinners. Therefore, uh, she can con comfortably become pregnant, have children, and then if and when it degenerates over a period of time, we can always re-replace this with a mechanical or a tissue valve depending on her age at that particular point in time. Now this procedure is fairly new. Uh, it has been in vogue for the past 10 to 15 years. As the procedure itself says, uh, it was done by many surgeons in the past, but has been standardized and kind of popularized by a Japanese surgeon called the Ozaki. And by his own data, at least 10 to 12 years data that he has published is showing that 95% of the people do not require a reoperation for failure of this valve, at least for a period of 10 years. Now, of course, this is not a very long term data, but this is what we would call in medical literature as medium term data. So, so far the evidence is very promising and I just wanted to inform you all about this new kid on the block. Thank you very much for listening.